You remember Karen Matthews? Oh, the she, one who um, was the old, the, who had the kid the f- under the... Fake kidnapping. That's yeah. right, yeah, yeah, yeah. She's got her, her daughter, um, Shannon Matthews. That's right, Hid yeah. her under, yeah. under her uncle or something like that. Her uncle's That's bed, it, yeah. under the bed. Anyway, apparently she's sort of getting out soon. Right. Um, but it says here, um, Mum from Hell, Karen Matthews, taking a prison course on how to be a good parent. <laughs> yeah, this is fucking brilliant, this. Um, Matthews, who faked the kidnap uh, in a ploy to claim reward money. So, a 35 year old mum of seven. Jesus, yeah, I remember seven yeah, kids. Loads of kids yeah. isn't it? He's learning to manage budgets, <clears throat> right? Kit out a flat and even bake fairy cakes. Oh. This is like, you know, this is a little course <laughs> they're doing in prison. Uh, a source said the course is very popular with prisoners, uh, which is hardly surprising because it's so relaxing. This is fucking. You know, I'm so. Of course, it's relaxing, fucking baking fairy cake. And this is really good. The tasks include being given an Argus catalogue and a pretend budget of £500 and told to pick out items for your home. So basically, the cult is. Is fucking. Well, let's fucking bake some cakes. And then, here's a fucking Argus book. Yeah. Imagine you've got 500 notes. And buy some <laughs> buy some fucking tat for your flat. You know? So obviously like all these chaps first thing can do is like what fucking five hundred pounds worth of plasma T V obviously, <laughs> <Yeah>. you know. <laughs> He's it. got us taking a fucking yeah. watch, isn't he? <laughs> I've right. got seven fucking kids. Am I supposed to fucking look after keep, him? Keeping quiet, you know, yeah, shoving front of the fucking C B B S on. That's it. You know what I mean? In the evening the older kids can watch some filth. <laughs> so she's obviously picking out a fucking like a massive bed big fucking hollow one she can keep all her kids in it's fucking it's like just, just fucking shut up and stay in I had them under the fucking bed yeah but there was all that talk at the time weren't there about um, how like you know these people came out didn't they and they raised money for uh, yeah and all the yeah. rest of it but they were saying like and then she got like a complete cunt in obviously when I found out she was just like <laughs> yeah. on the fiddle but they were saying but then they started arguing, maybe it's because, like, you know, her daughter weren't quite as pretty as that Madeline McCann. Oh, well, right, right. That's what? why everyone went, like, mental, because they were saying, like, <laughs> the thing was, well, they were saying, like, because like, Madeline McCann's family were, like, yeah. you know, it was terrible what happened with her, but like, was, they were both doctors. Yeah, they were they're professionals. Doctors, yeah. And, uh, and everything else, you know what I mean? And mm. she was a pretty sweet little young girl, you know yeah. what I mean? Whereas that Shannon Murphys was a, do- a dog sponger <laughs> and her kid was obviously fat and overweight. A kid looks she- a bit like, when you look at the pictures, she looks a little a little bit like Ricky Gervais. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, That's a cheap. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it does. Yeah. But there's all this argument, like, you know, they were saying, like, oh, would there have been such an uproar if it had been, like, a middle class family? And I was just thinking, no, the uproar was. Madeline McCann actually got kidnapped. Yeah. She didn't get kidnapped. That's <laughs> what the uproar was fucking about. Up, yeah. yeah, do you know what I mean? It's like, you know, in one case, a kid got fucking kidnapped yeah. and taken away and no one knows what happened. In another case, she just got hid in her uncle's <laughs> fucking bedroom. I'd like to get inside their minds and, and, try and have a look around and see, you know, have a look at the scene they imagined was going to happen at the end because... <laughs> Where did they ever fucking hope to get away with it? It's like, been a sort of like, a oh, fucking fanda. Let it all you know. blow over. Yeah. And it's like, oh, we found her at the bottom of the garden. Yeah, yeah. what's the kid going to say? Say, yeah. yeah, we found her, we fucking struggled with these blokes. Fucking <laughs> dragged her away from them. <laughs> no, I, I chin one of them, you know. And can I, I be 30 grand? He's had the can. <laughs> 30 grand there, please. <laughs> and the kids are going to say, oh, is that really what happened? She's no, I was on a fucking bed for a fortnight. <laughs> It's going to be like... like it was a pot of fucking yeah. noodle every day. Oh, right, I'll stop writing this fucking <laughs> check out then, shall I? The kid's <laughs> just fucking giving the game away. <laughs> it's fucking stupid. Yeah, but the thing but, is, yeah. right, also, didn't, like, you know, be funny or anything, right? Maybe <laughs> like, it's just fucking me. Yeah? <laughs> but when the old Bill were asking a few questions, yeah? Yeah. Don't you think they should have asked something like, do you have any family in the local area? Has she gone to that house? Yeah. And then they go round that house and they turn around and they go, Oh, here she is, look, she's under the bed. <laughs> Don't you think old Bill might look a bit fucking harder? Well, yeah, I mean, you know what I, mean? I think 
I mean, they all moaned well, about the Portuguese police, like mm. with Madeleine McCann. Yeah. So they didn't give a fuck, and they didn't. Jo- well, they didn't give a fuck even, did they? Because she was only three hundred fucking yards yeah. down the road. But well, the thing is, it's, it's one of those. It's quite a sensitive thing, and if the kid goes missing, it, the, probably the last thing the parents going to want to hear was, "All right, what you done with her?" You know. Yeah. But so they got to sort of tread quite carefully, I suppose. Yeah, but, but he, you would fucking. Uh, a... Didn't they go round his house or something? I think and so. That's why she yeah. was under the bed, just yeah. fucking hide out of the way. Yeah. Because. At but, the very no. least, they'd go around and talk to him and say, well, when was the last time you see her? And he'd be like, oh, just five minutes. I mean, not fucking five minutes ago. What am I talking about? Um, you know, I'll see her, oh, two weeks, you know. But the thing is, Tony, yeah, what's all these fucking toys all over the floor for? <laughs> oh, I'm a paedophile. <laughs> so I cover it up, you know. <laughs> but the thing is, right... It's not like these cunts live in some kind of palatial mansions, is it? No, that's You can right. miss them because they're not playing in the grounds. <laughs> they're like, and the grounds are like six miles of fucking way, right? Yeah. They live in a two up, two down in fucking Burnley or wherever yeah. she's fucking from, yeah? So it's like, you come around here, there's only a certain amount of places that a child can fucking hide. Yeah. You're not going to hide in the drawers over there, are they? Because a nine-year-old yeah. child ain't going to get in there. Or under the sofa, unless they're like some kind of limbo king or something, right? But if you go upstairs and there's a big child shaped fucking lump under the mattress. Well, what are you going to do? You're going to go upstairs, like, you, it's a bit fucking, you know, because, God, that's not tearing her ass apart. But you're going to fucking go up, like, first thing you do, let's just fucking jump up and down on the bed for a minute, you know, see if we can hear any fucking, yeah. ow, you yeah. know. Even, even like if you can't be asked. <laughs> That's right. Even if you're an old boy who can't be asked of it, you're like, oh, just bunch of pikeys. Yeah. They do this shit all the time. <laughs> but right? At least what you do is you pull out the big drawer from under the bed, <laughs> wouldn't you? You know, the big, massive fucking drawer that apparently she was laying in. You might pull that drawer out and just have a little rummage around, wouldn't you? Yeah. You know what I mean? Just to see if they're like, you know, oh, I can't be bothered. I'll just pull well, that fucking drawer out and then we'll fuck off. Trouble is, what they're going to do now is... If any common person loses a, chi- a kid again, yeah. the old girl going to go around and they're going, oh, fucking up. And once bitten, twice shy. We're not going to fuck about it this time. They're going to go in, they're going to slice open every bit of fucking furniture they've <laughs> yeah. got, I know. Fucking delvies around inside it. They're going to be fucking fluff and feathers everywhere. <laughs> they're going to be just smashing up their sideboards. <laughs> yeah, you chav cunts. <laughs> <All right. Yeah. laughs> this is all procedure. <laughs> Fucking Brain fucking Sharon Matthews, you can't. <laughs> That's it. Kick yeah. put a foot through yeah. your TV. <laughs> your How could she be in the TV? <laughs> We've got a check. We've got a check. We've got a check. <laughs> we got a check. It's all because of fucking Matthews, you wankers. Yeah. We found her in there, you wouldn't be moaning there, would you? <laughs> it's not fucking Carol she Ann. Was... It's not fucking Poltergeist. <laughs> She might have slipped down the back of the sofa. Yeah, yeah, let's true. have a look. Rip. <laughs> 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 Just ripping shit up. I don't know. Yeah. But no, but, that's yeah. what they were saying at the time. But, but the thing oh. is, right, I mean, you look at her, right, she's obviously mental, right, she's obviously like, she's been let down, isn't she? But they, but the society's created them, Tone. Yeah. That's society's right. created them. It's, what's that? It's my fault now, is it? No, it's not your fault. <laughs> I'm just saying. No, but, but yeah. They, she's fallen it's, through so many fucking... Well, yeah. Oh, isn't she? But there's, was, she's like fucking there's... Alice in Wonderland. This yeah. cat. She's fucking. <laughs> there's so many, many burrows. Yeah, there's too many fucking people in the world. We can't keep track of them all. Can we? It's <laughs> probably so like. There's fucking millions of idiots out there. They're it's all plotting these time, things, isn't it? Isn't it? It's evolution. Because yeah. eventually they'd do... Well, they won't know, will they? They well, won't no, die well, out. Well, it's not evolution. Because it's cunt of breeding. It's not evolution anymore, is it? Because they've got the fucking NHS. So yeah. all these cunts, normally, they'd have been fucking eaten by a bear or something. Yeah. That silly cow. Because they're stupid, yeah. Yeah, they'd have been fucking... Oh, look, it's a bear. You know, we'll hide our kid in that bear's cave. <laughs> and then... <laughs> you know, <laughs> they'd all be brown bread. But, um, I was yeah, watching a programme on it the other day. They just don't fucking die anymore, do they? 